two. Up, forward, forward. Get your chest up right now. More, more. Go. Pull it apart. Shove it. In my hand. Good. All right. One thing you can instantly do that's going to enhance your bench is learning how to shorten yourself under the weight. What does that mean? So when you're here, the tendency when people are new is to push the weight out to get an arm the weight. I want you doing the exact opposite. I'm going to pull it in. Pull it forward and let the weight drop down. So you got to straighten your arm. If your arm is bent, none of this works. It's going to be right. your shoulders. So you got to lock the arm, pull the weight forward, let the weight of the bar shove you in the bench. So when I'm taking out weight, I'm actively squeezing down. So not only am I pushing down, the way the bar is pushing into me too. But you'd be amazed how light you can make big weights feel by having the right control. It's just like squatting. You know, as you get more uh, accustomed to the monolith and learning how to unwrap big weights, you'll find that it almost feels effortless. The bench, uh, my goal when I'm taking a big weight out is I want to be able to uh, not be able to tell if my handoff guy is still holding it off by the time he's let go. If it feels like it weighs virtually nothing at arm's length, no matter what the weight is, and I've done my job of creating more muscular tension on the bar than there is weight on the bar. Otherwise, if I'm holding it here and I'm thinking, oh shit, I've got to keep it off me, right? Right. That's not a good place to be because you don't have anything that's working for you. Right. If you come out and it feels light and you can exert your force against the barbell, you have a much greater chance of being successful by the time it gets to the bottom. Because this is really all about you lowering the bar down to try to build the greatest possible advantage you can get out of the bottom of the lift. So if it's sloppy or if it's loose or if it's, if it's rushed, none of those things give you advantage. If you pull maximum tension in the bar and you're forcing your chest up and you touch the perfect spot, that's the best you can do to put yourself in position to make the next lift. Yeah.